so how we'll prepare students for their future really focusing in four areas which begins with their early foundational skills uh, really supporting with literacy uh, in middle school and their math skills prior to algebra getting ready for that uh, we know we can only do that if we have great teachers in every building and great uh, principals in every building who who understand that uh, and who are working every day toward maximizing the instructional time for students uh, and then career empowerment and preparation is really important for us. Um, we want every high school to have a robust advanced academic and career and tech ed program. Uh, we want students to be exposed to their aptitudes, uh, testing and, and areas of interest uh, and with local businesses coming in to be part of schools, kind of in middle school and high school so that students have a good idea uh, of what they want to be uh, when, when they leave school uh, and how they want to do that. And then finally, we need to, success for every student, which means uh, we need to make sure we're providing the supports uh, and interventions for every student to be successful and the opportunities to do that. Now, when you mention career tech, what does that encompass? So career tech education will encompass anything uh, when you think about in career fields from, uh, it could be from the, from the trades like masonry and plumbing, all the way up to things like STEM jobs, like pre-engineering. Uh, it, uh, it could be health science programs. It could be business programs. So uh, their kind of career tech education is kind of really based around uh, kind of workforce development and that sort of thing. How is that separate than the, the standard um uh, academic workload. So when you think about kind of a, a kind of the standard academics, you're kind of thinking about science, English, math, social studies, kind of those core uh, accountability kind of areas. And so really there's a fuse of both of those. What career and tech education does is those exposures kind of give you hands-on experiential uh, to kind of prepare you for uh, life afterwards. Where in uh, the other core areas that I mentioned earlier, you're kind of getting more uh, like straight knowledge and theory. It's kind of it's kind of the knowledge and theory and then a career tech age you apply that uh, and be able to use it and see how it's going to function in the real world.